Gabriel Vidovic maakte tegen FC Emmen zijn eerste doelpunt voor Vitesse. Een mooie reden om met de aanvaller af te spreken in Hartje Arnhem bij Hotel Haarhuis. We willen alles weten over de Kroaat, over zijn leven, zijn tijd bij Bayern München en zijn eerste maanden in Arnhem. Maar ook wat zijn favoriete maaltijd is. Ik uh, would say pasta. Pasta? Yeah. Italian? Yes. Favorite music? Run this town. You know, from Jay-Z and Rihanna. Rihanna. Yeah, good. Yes. Favorite good movie? Song. Creed is good. And Coach Carter is also good. These two movies are good, yeah. What's your favorite series? Prison Break. Favorite number? Ten. <laughs> Who's your idol? Messi is my idol. Because when I was younger, yeah, I know I watched clips of him dribbling and then I went out and tried to do the same. What's your favorite position on the field? Yeah, offensive midfielder. But um, yeah, I can play. I like to play everywhere where the coach put me, like also left winger. Mason Mount or Martin Odegaard? Martin Odegaard. Karim Benzema or Robert Lewandowski? Lewandowski. <laughs> Augsburg or München? Augsburg. Yeah, from the city is Augsburg because uh, I lived there my whole life, grew up, yeah. When you first signed for, uh, for Bayern Munich, that was in 2016, I think. Um, how was that for you? Yeah, it's very special because, um, yeah, Bayern Munich is, Bayern Munich is, I think, best team in Germany, one of the best teams in the world. And, yeah, when you are yeah, a kid, a little kid, um, it's a dream one day to play for Bayern. And then if you come in the youth academy, it's also a big, big step. And, yeah, it was, yeah. I was very happy and proud, of course. So where do you live now? Where the zoo is, huh? The Burger Zoo. Yeah, it's a very good place. You've been here now for a couple of months. Um, how was that process for you? Just going, moving to a different country? When I came here, like, um, everyone was like with open arms and helped me from the staff, from the players, from the older players, from everyone. They. Um, made it like very easy for me um, of course living on your own and stuff like this is yeah something other than living with your parents but um, yeah my family is coming here my dad was here the first two weeks and helped me and he's still coming like to every home trying to come to every home game and i need to say i feel very good here um, also the city is very nice the people i feel very very comfortable because I live maybe 100 meters to the zoo. I was six, seven times already there because um, I like the aquarium, you know, the big one where the sharks in it. And I sit there and watch it for hours. And yeah, that's very nice also in the city. Um, I'm going, I was with my dad, also with um, like Tony, and we go something to eat, walking around. He helped me also a lot, of course, because I'm good with everyone, but um, with him, it's like from the first day, he take me and yeah, we are eating and yeah, playing also FIFA and stuff like this. Uh, let's talk about uh, one of your inspirations, because Luka Modric is one of your inspirations as well, yeah, right? Yeah, of course, he inspires me. Also, my dad, I look up to my dad. And my dad played football also very high, but um, it was not easy because, um, yeah, when he was like 18, like me, the war started there. So, yeah, he has it not easy. And after the war, he came alone. To Germany. To Germany, of course, also my mom. They made me the person I am, um, yeah, and I'm very, very thankful for that. And yes, but also to come back to Luca, um, yeah, also his life. When you see it, um, it was also not very easy. And I think um, every life has sometimes its downs, ups and downs. And yeah, you need to learn from them, and then try to come out the biggest as possible and I think when you look at this way yeah it's just something you can look up to it. How would you describe yourself? I think I'm a very um, yeah silent person I'm, I'm not talking too much but um, just want to help the team with my 
qualities and um, that we reach together um, the goals we have for the season. You scored your first goal last week. Um, it was your first goal in professional football. So what does that mean to you? Yeah, that is probably um, until now also one of the best days, of course. Um, no, but I'm um, of course happy because um, I helped the team. Like um, at the top is always the team and that we, um, like I said, um, reach our goals. And yeah, if I can help with a goal or with my good place, um, of course it makes me also happy.